This video will give you a quick demo of how to pair your optimized sensor to your smart device. First thing you'll need to do is download the Optimize app in your Google Play or Apple App Store. Once your app is loaded and ready, you will need to register your optimized device by creating an account. You'll need an email and phone number to register your device. Once you successfully registered, you'll receive an email to the linked account asking to verify the email you've registered with. If you check your linked email, you will see a message from Xylem Cloud asking for your verification. Open up that email and click on the Confirm My Account link. This link will bring you to the prompted web page to complete the registration. Here, you will use your email as your username and create a new password. Your password will need to meet the certain requirements as specified on the site. Once your password meets the requirement, you will have successfully created an account and should now log in for the first time on the same web page to finish registering your optimized sensor. Once logged in, the first thing you'll be asked to do is agree to our terms, conditions, and privacy policy. You can read through those terms and then accept. After accepting, you are then prompted to connect to, to your optimized sensor using the QR code directly on your device or by manually entering the serial number. Before connecting, you'll need to make sure you wake up your sensor by placing the supplied magnet over the Bluetooth icon until the LED blinks pink. After waking up my sensor, I chose to connect using the QR code. You'll see a quick flash of the optimized device and then the serial number is input automatically. A request to Bluetooth pair your device with the optimized sensor will pop up. Be sure to pair. You will see a message on the bottom of your screen stating, located the device, connecting. This lets you know the device is pairing with your sensor. Once connected, you will be able to input all of the sensor configurations for your optimized device. The installation date is automatically set. You will need to complete the remaining fields by using options from the drop down menus. You will have the option to choose between ISO or ANSI HI vibration standards. You can also change the sampling frequency to how often you'd like the app to pull information from the sensor. The axial, horizontal, and radial configurations are defaulted for you. Once complete, add the asset, and then you can customize your device with a pump name, specific location, and add an image. This optimized sensor is on an ESV pump in the boiler room. I then chose the ESV pump model from the drop down menu. Click save and you have successfully connected your smart device to the optimized sensor. You will now receive notifications to this main screen in the optimized app, which shows all of your connected sensors. Since this is the initial connection, there is no new data but after the chosen sampling frequency updates on vibration, temperature, and battery life will be found here on this screen.